2014 nang mapasakamay ni Manny Pacquiao ang WBO welterweight belt nang talunin ang champion na si Timothy Bradley. Anim na buwan ang nakalipas muling napasabak si Pacquiao sa isang malaking laban kontra sa undefeated American boxer na si Chris Algieri. Bukod sa pagiging boksingero, si Algieri ay dating world champion sa kickboxing. Ipinamalas ni Algieri ang tigas at husay sa boxing nang talunin ang Russian boxer na si Ruslan Probodnikov at natupad ang pinapangarap na maging world champion. Ipinakita ni Algieri ang kanyang tibay nang pagkatapos siyang pabagsakin ni Probodnikov ay nagawa niya pang makabalik sa laban hindi pa man nagkakaharap sa boxing ring matindi na ang patot siya dahan yeah, he's so cocky um, he better back it up because uh, I think Manny's gonna walk out there and knock him out in the first round dahil kilala sa pagiging agresibo at pagkakaroon ng pamatay na suntok si Pacquiao iyon ay mangyayari lamang daw ayong kay Algieri kung mahuhuli siya ni Pacquiao sa laban ayong kay Timothy Bradley ang boksingero na nakalaban ni Pacquiao bago si Algieri na hindi siya naniniwala sa mga pinagsasabi ni Algieri na hindi ito kabado sa laban niya kay Pacquiao. I don't care what people say or what he says that he's not nervous and all this. Yeah, you are, bro. Yeah, you are. Even the hardest, one of the hardest dudes from Palm Springs was nervous as hell against Manny Pacquiao. Pero kung piyansa si Chris Algieri na tatalunin niya si Pacquiao, at ipinakita niya pa ang forma na gagawin pagkatapos makuha ang panalo. When you visualize like what you're gonna do for the fight and mm -hmm. you win, how, how, what would be the perfect ending for you? How, how would you visualize it? Right here, I'll show you. That's the perfect ending for me. <laughs> Sa round 1, hindi na nahirapan si Manny Pacquiao na huliin si Algieri. Inupakan ng bodega at mukha ni Chris. That speed is... Distance, and I'm going to use my length. Bad thing about Pacquiao here is he's willing to. Pacquiao percentages have beaten. Good shot by Algieri. Algieri beginning to work his jab. That was what was missing in round one. Pacquiao begins to counter. Not only is he very fast, but he also is very focused. And down goes Algieri on a straight left hand. Algieri. That hey, I don't. That definitely was a slip, and it's water there. That definitely was a slip. So a bad break for Algieri. First round twice against Provodnikov. He goes down in the second round here. He hurt against Provodnikov and here he was hit as his foot was slipping in the corner. Lucky break for Pacquiao, but it counts as a knockdown. And shots against Manny Pacquiao. Pacquiao's yeah. way faster. Yeah, but Pacquiao hasn't really honestly hit him with a good clean punch yet until right here. Cut man, Jacob Stitch Duran with them for this fight. Big addition to their team. So the threat of Pacquiao is negating Alvin. That is by their design. Cards when you're not a knockout artist. Of course it is, but you still fight Manny Pacquiao. And the first four rounds get caught with something that you're not ready for. The fight could end. Meantime, Pacquiao has failed to create an action. If Algieri didn't want people are able to build rhythm and do better in the second half of the ring is that you get into chasing him. The way Purple to land a good straight right lead just did. Algieri's obviously the jab moments ago. Now gets in a body shot. Going to the body might be a good idea. Upstairs, keeping his left glove pinned to his cheek. Hard right hand by Manny Paxit through the first three. Okay, so you might get a three to nothing. Saron Pur. Nagkakapalipalipit na ang katawan ni Algieri pag tinatamaan ng malalakas na suntok ni Pacquiao. Si Algieri sinubukan pang gamitin ng jab para hindi makalapit si Manny. Figure him out. Make him punch while he's moving. Let some of the power and stuff in the steam blow off. If he stops and throws his hands more right now like, like Harold suggests, he'll be sitting on the canvas pretty shortly. He's not ready for that yet. Let Pacquiao blow some of this early slow the steam off. You're the least experienced of the two guys. Wait till the strong punching power is gone. Let him get into the fight a little bit. Then maybe we have a better chance of catch him. But you see right, right there. Right hand uppercut by Pacquiao. You see right there, he's not the fighter to kill Pacquiao. And Pacquiao is so physically good. And you heard him say in the corner at one point, you see him reaching. So as the rounds go on, they're hoping that Algeria's defense and length will have Pacquiao reaching. And Manny Pacquiao wanted to focus on body shots this round, and he has done damage with body shots to Algeria. Possible not to. Exactly right. 
As Roy and I talked over, hard left hand by Pacquiao. Hard right hand by Algieri. Now they want Algieri to assert himself more. And Perfect on the chin of man. It does not want some teams to walk into. First 30 seconds of the jab on the right hand. And the crowd's doing an awing, but Pacquiao's not landing. A pivotal round in the fight. Another cut in with that right hand. And he's not concerned in learning, landing nothing big because he only has a few knockouts anyway. Great body shot. You just put punches on Pacquiao like that. And, and that. a straight right hand and a left hook. That's their aim for him. Looks determined, and maybe this was Team Algeria's plan. But Pacquiao, when he gets boxed and hit, looks to score. Wouldn't surprise me if a judge had Chris Algeri winning that round. I Obviously, Algeri Max Kellerman no. thought that Max, that uh, Algeri. Yeah. Clean shots, and I saw Algeri land some clean shots. He was reluctant to throw the going. 100 more punches than Chris Algeri. The pro changed that equation early on. Makes Pacquiao deadly is that he is actually a volume puncher, he's just a power puncher. So that makes him more. And that's going to be the second knockdown. But the bottom line is, it counts as a knockdown. And let's see if Algeria still hurt. And Algeria nodded his hand like, yeah, his head like, yeah, he got me. Yeah, he hit him first. And, and he bumped him, but he did hit him first. So that is a legitimate knockdown, I think. He could. Extended right hand by Algeria momentarily. That's Pacquiao, but he keeps coming. Fires away with the left hand. Algeria goes down for the second time. Third time in the oh, fight. Yeah. to listen to him on that oh, point. No, he should stay out of that corner. Yep, stay out of, the cor of that corner. No question the water was at least partially a factor in that knockdown, but Manny's knocked him down twice in this round. With Manny a little because he's been boxing, he's been moving. I, I don't think he's won around because he has his game plan and stayed there. Six to nothing, Manny Pacquiao. Top percentage. He's just not that kind of fighter. Back in that corner again, they better can sting him with a shot. He can he can snap his head back and make him. To be, this is what you wanted. Trying to remind him of the mindset of confidence. A fight in which, so far, as you see on his unofficial scorecard, he essentially give away the first four rounds. You, and you're not a big puncher. You have to be perfect the rest of the way. I think it's a bad plan. It is a bad plan, but that's the only chip plan he could have. This Manny Pacquiao countering one, two, three. I know against the southpaw, sometimes you can throw that lead right almost like a jab. But it's it's dab and he just he shelved it for weight. Hasn't been a single clinch. Gina Rod Let's go to the corner of Chris Algieri, where Max Keller. Round ten. Round round ten or eleven. I'm eleven. Go. Well, that's going to make it difficult for the fan to because there's a question now Seven. as to whether Algieri will be able Nine. to survive that shot, which was oh, yeah. a monster oh, yeah. left hand, a sensational oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. straight left cross All right. by Manny. That put Algeri on his back, and let's see what Algeri has left. He doesn't have much left, Jerry, and that hurts more because he's already uh, uh, picked him. That's that's an Algeri oh. method. Oh. Take, oh, five hey, and six. Here, okay, great, man. Okay. All right, let's go. Bye. Six knockdowns in the fight so far for Pacquiao. Algeri better hold, or the fight's over. There he is. Held for a little while. Couldn't hold on long enough. It's Pacquiao who's out of his cage. Yeah. <laughs> He's still fighting though. Algier is showing guts. Big guts. Pacquiao in control. Big guts. Huge guts. And I wouldn't let Pacquiao finish him at least because he doesn't. He jumps in too soon. He ruined a good fight. I miscounted. You're yeah. exactly right. But B is Manny Pacquiao Six on, on the, the offensive, way. right? More defensively oriented counter punch. Turned out to be 100% correct. And my mind is blown. <laughs> but as he saw, he has a sense, kind of like what Max says. The uh, Pacquiao, where class has told over time against Tim. Oh. I got you. Oh. Hey, come on forward. You all right, Chris? Good. Yeah. All right, box. And, oh. and 
five. Algeria comes back for the 11th round. Back up apparently in the last few hours as betters here got in their money on Pacquiao. A perfect fight. Of course, assumes that there's never to be a Floyd Mayweather fight. If that at sa round 12, umaatras na si Algiri, bugbug na ang katawan at ulo, pero si Manny tuloy pa rin. Strategy was a faint wish. There's another hard right hand by Algeria. Pacquiao is a little bit more open in this round as he drops his hands and tries for a knockout. From here to Siberia. It's a long, long way. Pagkatapos ng impresibong panalo kontra kay Chris Algeri, nakasan na pinakahihintay na laban ni Pacquiao kontra kay Floyd Mayweather pero nabigo si Pacquiao na talunin ang undefeated na si Mayweather. So yan lamang po ang gusto kong ishare sa inyo ngayong araw sa mga kaibigan at kababayan natin sa Pinas, mga boxing fans at mga tulad kong OFW saan man panag sa mundo. Kumusta po kayong lahat dyan? Kung nagustuhan nyo po itong aking video, pakilike at kung po pwede rin po, mag-subscribe na rin po kayo. Maraming maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Shout out kay Aja Nieva, Clifford Lee Bautista, Jennifer Jan Sumawa ng Pampanga, XT Micaso, Nick Ramos, Jan Marabillas, Alvin Sulon, at Jay Bulanyo ng Cagayan de Oro, Chrysler Prince Loable, Admer Kasigi, at kay Mr. Alfonso Cortado ng USA. Maraming maraming salamat po sa pagsuporta nyo sa aking channel. Music